Today Ronaldo's success has made him one of the most follow human beings on Instagram. He's got over 500 million followers, and I can't even get 100. Despite all this success, Ronaldo's remain grounded to his roots. His dedication and passion for the sport have made him stay at the top for all these years. But it's different now for Ronaldo. Because back then, he was only worried about himself. But now he's got kids, and everything's changed. Out of Ronaldo's five kids, Cristiano Jr. is the one with the most hype. I mean this kid is unreal. His YouTube skill comps and highlight reels have gotten over 10 million views. And I'm one of them. Cristiano Jr.'s life looks perfect. He's got a celebrity dad. And his dad's partner, Georgina Rodriguez, she's an Instagram supermodel and influencer. So with all this success on social media, Junior decided he'd open his own IG account to take after his dad. So he created Mini Cristiano Ronaldo 2010. And in less than 24 hours, he had over 1 million followers. The kid wasn't even 10 years old. That's my dream. Most dads would be happy if their kids were blowing up on the internet. But when CR7 immediately found out about Junior's IG account, he had him take it down immediately. Junior was upset. So one day after training, he walked up to his dad and handed in a special request. Then after that, Junior said this. Hey dad, can I have an iPhone? All my friends have one. Plus, I want my own stuff now. Ronaldo instantly said no, and left Junior crushed. See he later revealed in a press conference in Dubai, that the reason he refused to let Junior have an iPhone, is because he didn't want him to distract him. Technology has helped me, helped everyone, and we have to make the most of it, but I can't let it distract him. Ronaldo even threw in Junior's dieting habits and his crazy love for Coca-Cola to throw everyone off guard. But he wasn't fooling anyone see. The real reason Ronaldo refused to get Junior an iPhone is because of a dark secret he's been hiding for years. Because Ronaldo knows that if Junior finds out, he'd hate him for life. In 2010, after Ronaldo signed for Real Madrid, he went on holiday to the United States to celebrate. After a couple first-round drinks, he called the waitress over and asked for seconds. Only this time, Ronaldo wanted more than drinks. He wanted to get in on the waitress's action too. So she came over to his hotel room, spent the night, and Ronaldo flew down to Madrid. It was supposed to be the end, but a few weeks later, Ronaldo's phone rang. And when he picked it up, he got shocking news. I'm pregnant. Ronaldo recognized the voice, and it was the waitress from the bar in the US Sea. He was 25 back then, and the thought of being a dad for the first time made sense to him. But there was one catch. He didn't want anyone knowing about his sneaky links back in the US. So he struck a deal with the waitress. Now pay you 10 million pounds if you hand over full custody of the child and say nothing. Whoa, she didn't have a choice, and accepted the deal. So after Cristiano Jr. was born in 2010, she disappeared like she never even existed. Today Ronaldo has kept her identity a big secret. No one knows her name, not even as close as rivals. He revealed that when Jr. was finally old enough, he'd tell him who his real mom is, but he doesn't want to do it because some people have forced him to. Now Junior's just a kid, and Milano knows that. Was social media around? If Junior has a phone and does his research, he'll eventually find out who his mom is, and ruin the master plan he created for years. That's why he took down Junior's IG account, and only lets him use his phone under supervision. Instead Ronaldo's trying to become the best father in the world to Junior and his siblings. That's why he takes them to training sessions. They got a ton of clubs practicing in their backyard. Ronaldo believes that Junior will succeed him in football. 
so he needs to get rid of anything that can stop him from achieving his full potential. He knows if Junior finds out who his real mom is after all these years, they'll crush him. But you see guys, Ronaldo isn't just living a double life to his son, but his entire fan base too. He's got a ton of other secrets he's been hiding, like his million dollar car purchase that set a world record. Want to find out what I'm talking about? Click the next video.